Hi guys, wow, my bum is absolutely soaking, my jacket's soaking. Luckily I've got a, um, a waterproof um, like a cover for my uh, mind shift gear bag. And what I've had to do is I've literally, the plan today, I've come up to a place called um, Falton Knot and the plan was to get some moody skies or um, just to get to try and capture some weather fronts going past. And as you can see when I was walking up with the drone footage, um, it was quite relaxed, but when I got to the top, it was just kind of like a mad dash. I've had to literally hide behind these, um, this livestone paving, crap all my gear on, get the beach towel out, and just take cover, to be fair. Um, there's another weather front coming now, and um, I'm hoping to capture the, the original subject, which is a, a couple of these lone, a lone trees on the limestone pavement. But just over there, now we can see this beautiful light. This the storm just come flying past. And what I'll do is I'll just show you quickly, just now, Those little red dots are where the lightning was hitting. Now I'm at a place called Falton Knot, which is just above, um, I think it's called Carnforth. And so the lightning was probably just going, I don't know, probably half a mile that way. And it was great to see, but as usual with lightning, it's very difficult to, to capture when you're trying to get everything dry first. So I was a little bit caught unawares, but hopefully in a minute, as this other weather front goes past, hopefully I'll be able to get a couple of good shots. What's quite nice is the limestone pavement some of the actual rocks have got water in them um, if they don't disappear but they make they make a nice reflection so in about 10-15 minutes when this this second wave goes past I'm going to try and get a few shots there's a nice little lone tree over there there's a couple over that way but we'll see how we get on So I've got the camera set up there and basically what the, what the plan was, I've not even got all the gear out at the moment, this camera's doing a time lapse. That was going to be the subject there, that tree, and as you can see, I'll just turn the exposure down. There's like a gap now with a weather, weather front coming and I'll just spin right around the camera where to where I was just stunned, I was just hiding. But if you just look over there, it's so bright now in the distance. I'll do the video zoom in again that it can zoom in. I'll just hold it there for one second and I'll just kind of zoom in. But no, it's it's absolutely beautiful over there. I'm just hoping the plan was to just cap some mood on these trees. There's a little one over there. I think I'm going to go over that one, I think. I think it's a tiny one. I think I'm going to move because I'm not too keen on this one. Because if you look, I've just turned the exposure up again. Sorry, up. There's just a little tree to the right, to the left hand side there. And I think, I don't really want to clone anything out. So I think it'd be better if I found a different subject. But as you can see, the rain's coming back again now. So I think it's all the gear in the bag and try and hide again for 10 minutes. And we'll see how we get on. Hi guys, as you can see, whew, the wind's picked back up again, but I'm really struggling at the moment because it's really gone really bright again. And so, when you have a lovely tree, 
you can never seem to find something to lead you up to that tree and also as well when the weather is really bright even the best tree in the world for me for me personally it just doesn't, just doesn't look really good enough I've walked around for a good half an hour now and um, nothing's catching my eye and when I come to these places these limestone pavements you have to have something that goes wow and then you try and get the conditions around it but today at the moment at this moment in time I'm really struggling to find a good combination of all three so good light the wind is actually howling at the moment uh, and the rain and then the blue sky so what I'll do is I'm gonna walk around for another 10 or 15 minutes I'm just gonna try and get one shot if I possibly can I'm not gonna um, I'm not too bothered today it was good about coming out and getting some exercise but as you can see the hats nearly blowing off the winds really strong but it's just not there's just no mood and we need mood to make a nice photo so I'll try I'll try and crack on again and then um, I'll speak to you in a bit So guys, as it starts to rain again, I think I'm going to call the vlog an end here because I think out of the, all the times I come out, I think maybe, I don't know, say if I come out 10 times, I think three of them are completely writ off and I think this is just one of those days. I think um, I had an idea in my mind, oh let's go and get some stormy trees um, at fault and not, and it's just not happened today. Um, I think sometimes we when we, I normally go out to do a vlog in fact I don't normally go out to do a vlog I, go out, I normally go out to take photos and enjoy myself and then when I'm out I think I'll do a vlog well today I thought you know what I will go and do a vlog and I think sometimes you lose that bit of um, bit of a spark you lose that bit of um, momentum really I think sometimes when you're out enjoying yourself then you do the video um, today for instance trying to get a video has made me kind of um, concentrate more on getting the video than the shot and um, it's been great it's been great I've been I loved it to be honest but I just haven't got any Im worthy images to post I think I've got one I might post one now um, but nothing nothing to write home about so I think sometimes it's like a compromise these vlogs are about showing people what I get up to and I think if you want a really good shot for me personally because um, I think sometimes you're better off leaving the camera behind and getting the shot or get the shot first and then make up a vlog 10 minutes after you've got the shot um, today I've tried to vlog and take photos at the same time and it's not quite worked today but the weather conditions have been really good but they've been really good at the wrong location they've been really good they've been really bad at the right location so if I would have sat it out maybe it would have been differently or I don't know what I could have done different but um, I think just honestly I'm going to put it down as a bad day today um, but I've enjoyed it the photography side of it's been really good I've really enjoyed it I've not got any images to show but the adventure and the running around and chasing and hiding hiding like this behind stones it's all been good and I've enjoyed it so realistically um, on that point I probably would but as an image I've probably lost so it, you've got to try and get a happy balance to be fair I think the way I normally do it is go out get the image then do try and then try and do a vlog afterwards and that's the best way to do it I do the b-roll when I'm walking to it and that's why I do a lot of b-roll and that's why my vlogs are kind of loads of b-roll at first because I'm concentrating on that and then when I get to the location I'm actually concentrating on getting a photo not doing the videos um, so and as I look towards Blackpool now there's another weather front coming in and I think to myself you know what I could keep stopping here and stopping here and stopping here but sometimes just call it a day and uh, start again on another day and that's what I'm going to do really so I'm going to get my bag get back to the car go home and have a chippy tea I think well, and uh, just chill out with the wife and kids tonight and maybe go out tomorrow afternoon but as I see the sun's in my face now and it's it's like kind of high contrast where you've got the really bright lights on the trees and the, the moody skies behind but it's just trying to find that tree so anyway we're going to call it a day there I uh, hope you've enjoyed it. Hope you, uh, yeah, hope you've enjoyed my waffling. I hope you've enjoyed what I try to do. 
and until next time, take care.